fiction. Survival. A name. My own language. My religion. Cared for. Life. My friends. Expression. To play. Privacy. Listen to. Be taken seriously. An education. Every time a baby is born in Scotland, they are born with these rights and more. Now, nah, wee man, that's a good thing. Your rights are set out in the United Nations Convention of the Rights of the Child. Or because that's awfully hard to say, the UNCRC for short. We've even got our own commissioner to help children in Scotland understand their rights and to make sure all of us, from birth until we are 18, or 21 if we've ever been in care, have our rights respected. Hi, I'm Tam Bailey, and I believe that Scotland, one day, will be a place where all children and young people understand, experience, and exercise their rights. But in order to make that a reality, we'll all have to work together. And the people who know best about being a young person are young people themselves. Last year, I asked you... Who, me? And me? Yes, all of you. What do you think are the most important things that I should work on in the next five years? What was most important in four different areas of your lives? We know this, we know this. In our homes. In our communities. Where we learn. In the country we live in. Scotland! Scotland. See, I remember this, Tam. This was called a right blether, wasn't it? Yes. And 74,059 of you cast your vote to tell me what were those things that were most important to you. And this is what you said. To be safe and secure. To be safe and respected. To have the same chances. No matter how much money our families have. To be included. And now I'm working hard to make sure that things get better in those areas which you said needed special attention. Oh, that's brilliant, Tam yourself. But that's an awful lot for a wee cartoon man to do. He's not really a cartoon. He's a real person. He's being a cartoon to be friendly. Well, how was I to know? I am a real person and this is a real job and you really do have rights. For instance, your right to learn. OK, I know UNCRC is a big document but it's broken down into smaller units and they're called articles. For instance, Article 28 and Article 29 are your right to an education and what that should mean. Develop your personality and talents. Oh, and your mental and physical abilities. Developing your respect for human rights and freedoms. For your parents and your cultural identity. For Scotland and for countries and societies where we may have come from and others that are different from our own. It should prepare us to live responsible lives in a free society. To value equality and tolerance. And learn how to have respect for and care for our environment. And this is just the starting point. Your education should be all of this and more. In Scotland, the government are committed to the UNCRC and making sure children have the best start in life and are ready to succeed. It has created a curriculum for excellence. This is the name given to the way that you should receive your learning experiences and opportunities. Your education should make sense to you from the age of three to 18. It should help you to learn in exciting ways that will keep you really interested. And prepare you for being a successful learner and a confident and responsible person. Your learning should give you skills for life and work as well as getting qualifications. It should help you take care of yourself and keep well. And at the end of that education, you should get help to take those next exciting steps into your adult life. To keep up to date with Tam's work and to learn more about children's rights, go to www.sccyp.org.uk. Hope to see you all there. Bye. Bye. See you later.